hello friends um welcome to jx power so again i'm just here with a big question and with the answer the biggest question and the most complicated question is who am i it sounds very simple who am i so i will just tell you that i'm pravesh i live here this is my age uh, and this is my quality qualification and everything but this is not the reality this is not the exact answer of the question so we were discussing about the most complicated question who am i uh, just many more time before some years uh, i think uh, one one person only one person or no just not exactly one person two three person uh, actually I'm a teacher I just teach in a school and one time the principal of that school asked me the same question I mean he asked me the question that tell me who am I I just told him that I don't know the answer you just tell me but he gave me the answer but in a bookish way and I'm just telling you the reality that who am I so who am I I am not this body actually we have the misunderstanding that this is me this is me this is my body this is my body this is the right point this is my body what I say just think about it I said this is my body that means this is not me this is my body so who am I I am just the soul with another part I'm not just only the soul because if I was only the soul so soul doesn't speak up soul doesn't have any feeling soul doesn't feel anything it doesn't feel happiness it doesn't feel pain it doesn't feel anything so I'm I am the soul. The soul is the part of me, but I'm not just only the soul. I am the soul and my subconscious mind. Yeah, this is true. The soul and the subconscious mind is me. Some people say that I'm just a soul, only the soul. And uh, when I believe this cloth. Then I will leave this phrase. So only the soul will enter in another life. The soul will just leave my body. Nothing else will go with the soul. But this is not true. With the soul, our subconscious mind. Our subconscious mind is the part of our soul. That means I am the combination of the soul and my subconscious mind. Some people said, Lord Krishna said, soul doesn't feel pain, soul doesn't feel happiness, it doesn't feel anything, it doesn't know anything. That's true. But with the soul or subconscious mind is also connected. Soul doesn't feel anything, but our subconscious mind, it knows everything, it feels everything. And our subconscious mind is a big hard drive it has stored everything the memories of our past life the memories whatever will happen in our future life everything everything has been stored in our subconscious mind by the god and so just because of that uh, i mean some intent or uh, some some Crews, some people who has attained the Siddhi, they can see the future. Why they can see the future? Because after attaining the Siddhi, they can use their subconscious mind. And by using the subconscious mind, they can see each and everything. They can control everything. Because subconscious mind is the part of God. We know that many more people say that we are... The part of God we are means not this body this body is not the part of God 
aspect our soul and subconscious mind is a part of God. So who am I? I'm just a soul and my subconscious mind. I'm not this body.